because uh, where we are today, I would like to thank God and uh, everybody that has been supporting us. And uh, DJ Lee, you know, he has been there all the way. I would like to thank you very much, sir, and uh, the lovely wife, Karen, for supporting us. And, uh, you know, this organization, we started this organization on the 11th of October. And the idea was to bring Nigerians together, whether wherever you're from, religion is to bring Nigerians together. And that was the idea to make sure our platform, we have two platforms, Telegram and WhatsApp, it has really grown, and this is a combination of Nigerian students, Nigerian families and businesses, and to support them with any way we can with food, jobs, and accommodation. And what that means is that uh, we're not experts in accommodation of food, but we have people with your contact. And it has really worked. On our Telegram and WhatsApp, we have a member of more than 1,500 Nigerians all over Yorkshire. <laughs> and that is the main reason why I was breathing, because I can only thank God and the support a lot of people. My counselor have been supporting the Nigerian community for a long time. Thank you very much, sir. You know, we have a lot of business leaders, you know, uh, like uh, Chris Kenoris, you know, he has always been there supporting Nigerian students and Nigerian families. We have a lot of Nigerians that are coming to UK and they're having lots of challenges. But when you have people that can support you to help with jobs, accommodation and food, you know, not to talk of the supermarkets that have been giving us free food, and I can definitely tell you today that we have distributed up to 200,000 pounds of food to the other Russia. We have been embraced, we have been welcomed by universities, we have you know, all the major universities on our platform, University of Sheffield, Bradford, Huddersfield, Leeds, all and York, and etc. They've been supporting us, Nigerian families, you know. I don't know where to start from, but um, I would like to say thank you to everybody. And uh, today is just to celebrate our first face-to-face -face since COVID-19. We started this organization during the COVID-19 when people are struggling, and the idea came to me. And I just said, okay, bridging the gap between Nigerians and Yorkshire. And what does that mean when you see lots of Nigerians, they, 